Welcome to Cooking Curves Coding Class. Today, I'm going to show you how to use the IPFI API to find out what your IP address is. So, right here, I have my code running. This is my IP address, right there. Alright, I'm going to show you how to do that. Let's get started. we start, you're going to need to have the link to jQuery, which I'll put in the description, copied, and later you're going to want to copy the link to the IPFI API, which will also be in the description. Okay, so of course pop open your text editor, or whatever you prefer to use to write HTML. I'm using a text editor, because that's what I prefer. And the first thing you're going to want to do is open a doctype tab. Doctype. HTML. HTML. And I'm going to save this file to get the nice HTML colors. So I'm going to call it what's my IP address dot HTML. Alright, so now that I have the nice doctype tag, we're going to start with a P tag. P ID equals and give it a nice ID. I'm going to call it IP address. Close quotes. And inside the tag, don't put anything to close up that P tag because we are going to put the IP address inside of there. Alright, next open a script tag, type script src equals, and in quotes, paste in the link to jQuery. Alright, close quotes, and close that script tag. Script. Alright. Next, you are going to want to open a script tag. Script. And if you want to save yourself some typing, Copy the link to the API endpoint right now, because we're going to need it in a second. Dollar sign dot Ajax, open parentheses and open curly braces, URL, colon, and in quotes, paste in the link to the API endpoint, or type HTTPS colon slash slash API dot IPFI, it's spelled I P I F Y dot org slash question mark format equals JSON. Close quotes. And that is the link to the API endpoint, which will tell you your IP address. Comma success colon function open parentheses data that's what I'm gonna call the variable that's gonna represent the data we got back doesn't have to say data that's just what I'm calling it open curly braces document dot get element with a capital E element by ID open parentheses and then here's where you put the ID of that P tag you made up there I'm calling it IP address so IP address close quotes dot inner HTML inner HTML with a capital H T M and L equals data or whatever you called the variable right here dot IP semicolon and then close those curly braces that you opened right up there and then close the ones you opened a little bit earlier and then close the parentheses you opened right up there oh hey this made me notice a mistake I made I didn't close these parentheses after closing the quotes close those parentheses up there before the dot inner HTML otherwise your code won't work all right, add a semicolon at the end of everything and close the script tag. And guess what? 
that's it. Save that file. Pop open your browser. Let me just shrink this. And find the file on your computer. And let me find it. Here it is. Drag it into your new tab. And look at that! That's my IP address! So, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Buy my merch. And remember, where did you put your shoes?